No, everyone. I'm done again, man. I'm, you can tell my voice kind of back. Yeah. No, I've had no voice for the past week because I've just had a virus, but now I'm feeling a lot better. Voice is nearly back. Still coughing up all sorts of crap. Um, I was going to stand and record today, but no. Nope. One day I feel well enough to actually do it. Builders, drilling, hammering. Also, ripping the guttering down. Thank you, landlords, for that. So, I had to escape and come out in the whole city centre for a bit of a walk. Oh, trying to get some fresh air. It's a nice sunny day, got my water and boots. So, I thought, you know, get out. Try and see the positive side of things. That's how much this virus is actually. Um, Oh, I've been seeing more positive things. It actually drove me mental, and I didn't want to commit suicide. It was that bad. I couldn't sleep. I couldn't eat. I couldn't talk. So no one knew what the hell was wrong with me. When I was off my guts up. But you know, I'm back. I managed to get on the antibiotics. I managed to get better after a few days of being on them. Windy as hell. Might as hopefully avoid the wind for a bit. But yeah, it's, I've just started to feel a whole lot better, more positive. Happy, I've been bearing that much of energy to be able to feel it flowing through my hands, like, like my chi and my kai was flowing through my hands. If I walk all the water in the shot, I have no way of telling at all. But now I'm just that by the BBC, but I'm avoiding the wind and the sun because it's a very nice day, so I thought I'd just get out, go for a walk, and the fountains just magically turned off on Queen's Gardens. It's a bit quieter now, but um, yeah, it's a very nice day. There's a weird fiery ball in the sky and. Everyone is not running around in mad panic like a fork at fork, everyone would. Fork, fork. That, that's how bad my voice is still. Still not 100%. Um, still sound like I've been smoking like 80 cigarettes a day. But it's better I was watching between people pressing teenagers and this. And the wind's picking back up again. Bits where the wind is just gonna be pain the ass out here. There's a whole bunch of dogs just playing on the park. Can you see them running around around there? And the uh, Trinity bells ringing, all Trinity church bells. All the hoo ha there in the mix, there's a lot of wet going on around there in the churchyard. And a whole bunch of workmen magically made a hole in the floor and sat a the bones and put them in a plastic bag. And now there's all sorts of um and ah about if it's actually, um, if the work is all, I don't know if the bones are plague victims. Not as it's all for fun and games. I don't even more emotion my voice is this bloody virus. I always went to the doctors and said it's a virus or it's a flu. Even when I'm going with the virus. The only explanation to me being as bad as I am, basically. The whole, like the whole's getting a whole bunch of wet done at the minute. And there's little yellow bollards everywhere. And there's actually a national shortage of how many we've got. But let me know in the comments, I want you guys to take a guess. <coughs> Excuse me. I guess how many little orange barriers there is in the hole at the minute. As there's enough for a national shortage, so there's a lot. I want to even become a mascot, that's how bad it's been. I want to become a mascot. The dogs are still running around. These are the orange barriers I was on about. I want you guys to let me know just how many do you think they are in the hole right now. Because it is ridiculous. The amount of work being done, let's see if I can show you it. The amount of work being done is, it doesn't mean this amount of work done since World War II. So 
Actually, that's the level of work going on at the minute around the whole city centre. The whole thing, it needs to do it wrong. Just pass, like being pedestrianised before, they just never dug up the road and laid the brickwork back on top of it. The whole we all just need to do is when we get across this room. There's people in cars. There's a new pub open it's called a head of steam. Summer. I don't think it's you know, video game pleasure of steam, but you never know. Let's get down Winter Street where it's quiet. I've got people who've actually said um, in the comments before that the whole Looks like a really nice place. So, this is Princess Street, one of the most secluded spots in the entire city. I said, look how nice that is. But we warned people to not feed the pigeons in the garden. No. This is a stupidly nice street, some window open as I'll probably have a head pop in a minute. Yeah, look how pretty this street is. So this is one of the like, oldest, most secluded spots in the city. So, but yeah, I'm gonna get off because my voice is starting to run out now. So, like I said, let me know in the comments below. This is how many of those orange barriers you think there are here, and I'll let you know in a couple of days in another vlog. I'll catch you guys on the flip side. I'm gonna go home and see if the wet would have bugged off so I can actually record if my voice lets up. So, see you guys later. Bye! Miss you!